I joined an excursion to the Postoina Caves. It is an easy day trip from Ljubljana. The excursion was part of the Regent Seven Seas pre-cruise three-day Slovenia land package. When you arrive, you are dropped off in a huge parking lot and then make your way through some pretty landscape to a river, waterfall, and bridge. The caves are within a nature preserve, so it is quite a picturesque setting. Then you proceed up some stairs where there is a large plaza with at least five souvenir shops and several counter-style restaurants. To visit the caves, you travel up some more steps to an upper plaza where the views of the wooded area are quite beautiful. At the entrance to the cave were throngs of people. This was October, so I could just imagine it even more crowded in the busy summer months. Fortunately, because we were part of the Regent Tour, we bypassed the line and went right in. They immediately give you a little electronic device that you hold up to your ear to hear information on the caves as you travel along. I found it a little hard to use, but it was helpful to get an explanation of what you are seeing. To get into the caves, you get on a little train that felt like it was from a kiddie amusement park. The train buzzed us through 3.7 kilometers of tunnel, and you had to be careful not to bump your head. It eventually deposits you onto a path that you follow through the caves. The paths were smooth, but I saw people with limited mobility struggling when the paths had small hazards, inclines, and slippery wetness. There were hordes of people pushing through the caves, which made it a little less enjoyable. However, with all that said, the caves are truly stunning. The caves were formed over millions of years, and you will be amazed at how vast the entire cave system is. It seemed to go on forever. As you travel along, there are different colors, formations. I'll just let the images speak for themselves. After you travel about a kilometer on foot, the path spills you into a, wait for it, souvenir shop. They make you wait in a shop or a holding area before catching the return train back. It wasn't too long of a wait, but I wondered if they do that on purpose so that you purchase souvenirs. The train ride out was similar to the train ride in and deposited us at the cave entrance. Our group had a lunch in the facility before we boarded the bus to head toward Venice. Overall, I was certainly happy that I saw the magnificent caves and the surrounding nature preserve. The Postoina Caves are definitely unique, massive, and a spectacular sight. And if you'd like to follow more of my senior and solo travel journeys, please click subscribe below. Cheers!